Welcome to our Slimbox demo room. Today I'm uh, making a video on how to fold a Fefco 215. This is the typical auto lock box and it might seem a bit complex, but once you get the hang of it, it is easy. Fefco 215, I think it's a really nice box. It gives an aesthetic look to your products and it works especially good with small, thin, corrugated like F or E, uh, e flutes. So you can make almost a uh, primary packaging um, solution to your products with it. Um, so it's useful and you can uh, prepare it in advance uh, because it's a box that has to be closed with a glue flap. So let me show you how it works in our software. This is our software page where you can choose all the different models you can create with your Slimbox. Mind, of course, that in a production environment, the Slimbox will be connected by an API, so uh, your warehouse management system will automatically create the boxes you need for the product you're packaging. But okay, you can always create uh, from the website the boxes you need. And uh, this uh, episode where talking about how to fold and create a Fefco 215, the auto lock box. So I selected it and then you see the plane, uh, the, cor the corrugated that is in the machine here and it's uh, drawn on the plane. Um, I chose a little box 30 centimeters on 20 width and a height of 15 centimeters. Um, you could also choose to fill up your plane with more uh, boxes more so you can duplicate it for instance and it will automatically nest this drawing on the width of your corrugated so that's something interesting it is of course here uh, possible to change the parameters uh, what i like about uh, the slimbox software and box making uh, modules is that you can change for instance the glue flap um, i prefer a bigger glue flap so it, uh, helps me to close up the boxes as efficient as possible uh, but it is also possible here to change the thumb hole that's, that's this little hole you can use to access the lid uh, of the box you could say okay I don't want it and then you put it here in a zero uh, let's print this box I'll send it to the queue and then I'll show you on our table how to fold this one so this is the plano that comes uh, out of our machine and we have to start with gluing this box as a whole. So that's an easy one. We use the TEC 3040 with special glue so that dries in an instant and that's quite easy. Then we have, can you see this? Then we have this and then uh, <laughs> the mystery on how to fold it starts. Um, I like to put it on the side of the table like this and that makes it easy. I hope you can see this. We have three different parts. You have this part, I'll try to show it. That's what I call number one, the sides number two and then you have this part and that is the last one we're going to put in the, uh, to construct it. That it will close it up. So I'll show you how we start. One, the sides, they lock here. I hope you can see this. And then we have the last one, which is push it in with some force. And that gives you the beautiful box. So maybe second time I'll show you we have this sides we have this where we start with and this is in fact the one we use to lock the box up and uh, we use as a last one so just a quick second time just to show it to make sure we glue it up voila that is in an instant we open it up and now we have the three sides, one, two, and three. So one, two, and three. Voila. Well 
like that. And that's the way how to construct an auto lock box like the 215. So let me do a little recap on the Fefco 215. On the positive side, it is a beautiful aesthetic box. So you can use it as a premium solution to uh, pack your products. That's positive. Um, with its auto lock system, it is easy and fast to construct. On the negative side, it has a bit of a complex drawing that uses up more corrugated and the more lines we have, the slower it cuts with our Slimbox. Thank you for watching.